We're here, Darrenzo Manila, for our athlete of the week today. We have blue belt jujitsu competitor Francesca Adalizama. Congratulations for being Darrenzo athlete of the week. And who would you like to pr donate this check to? Tomorrow, victims advocate reaching out. Tell us how you got your start with the sport of jujitsu, and uh, what is it about the sport that you enjoy so much? I think that jujitsu in Guam is very family oriented. So I was introduced by my brother, Chad Ada, and one day he just brought me to the gym and I said I wanted to try it out. So that's what I did. And uh, how long have you been uh, doing uh, the sport of jiu-jitsu and competing uh, for purebred? I've been training going on 12 years now. I have been competing since the age of six and I started at the age of five. Well, congratulations on your bronze medal at the IBJJF uh, World Championships in Long Beach, California. Uh, how many matches did you have? And overall, how did the event go for you? I had two matches. My first, I won by points. And overall, it was just a great experience. I've been there before for Pan Kids, so it was great to level up, to be on another level with all the athletes that we bring to Guam by my gym, like uh, Renato Canuto, Jazari. It was just amazing to watch them and be a part of them. And what's that feeling like when you step onto the mat uh, representing not only your gym, uh, but the island of Guam? I think that it's slowly growing, but hopefully uh, jiu-jitsu expands and that everyone can live it just like me as a lifestyle. And let's talk about your long-term goals with the sport. Hopefully, Ever since this experience, I think I'm on my way to being a world champion, and hopefully I get there with my team. All right, congratulations. Stay tuned to our next Darren Tone Athlete of the Week. AUAM Sports.